Ewert en de Two Dragons, band uit Estland rondom uh, frontman Ewert Sunja. Vorig jaar verscheen het album uh, Good Man Down. Dit jaar voor het eerst op Lowlands, maar ze deden al veel meer. Ja, um, yeah, welkom at, uh, at the Lowlands Festival. I think you're the first Estonian band here. Is that true? The first band from... It might be. It's probably true, yeah. yeah. How is it with the rock scene in Estonia? Is there... Is it difficult to go to Europe when you're born, raised there? And is there what kind of music scene is there? Um, I I don't think it's uh, difficult, like to to go out. But it's just like it's a state of mind. Yeah, it's a state of mind. It's, it's like uh, nobody's really like really took taken any practical steps to oh, okay. to get out or like really, I don't know, met the right people or so. But there's, it's a really, really good scene, and I hope there's, uh, there's gonna follow a lot of Estonian yeah. bands. So you have to discover everything by yourself, or? Yeah, yeah, maybe. I mean, the uh, like Estonia is really, really tiny. So to play around Estonia, it doesn't, doesn't take a manager or a booker or um, a label or anything. So it's just you can really do it all yourself. Yeah, yeah. But to get out, you really need people who know how it works. Yeah. Stuff. What was the important step for you to came to Europe? Was it like gigs in the UK or Eurosonic Festival or that kind of things? Well, probably the most important thing for us has been the Eurosonic Festival. Yeah. Because, uh, I mean, we did that in the beginning of the year and uh, our whole summer has been booked with different festivals around wow. uh, Europe. So it has yeah. been like a, a really amazing uh, like a kicker for us. Yeah, lots so of managers came down there and a lot of different, uh, different uh, people from the industry. Uh, okay, we met a lot of new friends. Yeah, you did. <laughs> you can say so. Yeah, and you could. Yeah. They were here also today, or some of them. Yeah. Some of them, yes. Because that must be cool when you performed a gig in Groningen earlier in the year and you returned to Holland, completely different weather and lots and lots of people uh, at the gig. Were you surprised by the huge crowd? Uh, yeah, we found out about the number on the way here, okay. so it's yeah. quite impressive, really, really yeah, actually, impressive. On, on Tuesday we play a gig in, in Groningen. Okay. Yeah. And that's where we're going to end our like cool. summer touring wow. with Groningen, where ah. we started. Back because where we you, started. Li you liked Groningen, you like Groningen. Yeah. yeah. You yeah, performed in Vera? Sorry? You, you performed at the Vera Club or was it an outdoor festival? I, I think we played at the uh, music school. Or we played ah, at the music school. okay. Yeah. yeah, cool. But it must be nice that the circle is round. Or it and is. Uh, uh, did you feel there was more response on, on the last record here? Uh, when, you, when you were here in January, I think the record was. Was it out already in January? Not yet, I think. It was no. here. Yeah, it wasn't uh, out. In March or something? Yeah, it, it it has been out in Estonia since uh, April 2011. 11. Yeah, it was later here. here. I think in in uh, in springtime in yeah. in 2012 somewhere maybe in Ap April. April. Or May. Yeah. So, yeah. It, yeah. so when we have played the, here after that, you really see you see people all the time who know the lyrics. Yeah. You know, pe uh, we we saw I saw people today that have been coming to our concerts in Amsterdam or Utrecht or or anywhere else where we played so that's like the response is really yeah. like you can really see that people know must be must be nice for a band that you see that people understand the lyrics and yeah. realize what a cool band you are <laughs> yeah is there you. um, when you're touring lots I mean the whole summer is full is there time to write on new materials is there yeah yeah are you a band that's writing songwriting in the tour fan or Sort of we, we have good days and bad days. Okay. Or I mean, it, it's it it varies so much. Uh, sometimes you you really are in in a mood of uh, doing something intellectual yeah. in the van, and then the other day you, you don't really feel that way at all. No. So it's uh, but but I mean I think we've been lucky because. Mm -hmm. We have some new material, and, and we we we've been working on that, and uh, mm. and now when we get the break in in in, in autumn, then we we'll definitely have something already to really to record to work also, with yeah. and, and start some small recordings. But today also we played uh, we played one song from our first album. Okay, cool. And we played three songs from. The upcoming one, okay. the new one. So okay. we played three so it's brand also new songs. It, it can be also a rehearsal when yeah. you when you 
playing live and you see the response. Yeah, you sort of test them. You test, uh, I, I don't know if you test the audience, but you test it. You want to try it out on yourself if you can do it or if how you can do if it, it yeah. how it's best. So. And discover if it's an Ewart and the Two Dragons song. Exactly, yeah. Yeah. And that's yeah. So it's a test case sometimes for a song, and yeah. and else if, if if it's not feeling well, then you're not recorded for the record, or or then you go back to the rehearsal room and change something. Yeah. Because the song must be the same live as on the record. No, not necessarily. Not but necessarily, uh, but it must be recognizable. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. It will be fun if it's a completely different song. <laughs> okay. Hey, before the rain starts. Oh, it's getting better. Yeah. Um, I think this is the, f the last one for uh, for you this day, or do you have more press, etc.? I think it's the last one. N yeah, it's the last okay. one. Then you have to enjoy the festival. Yeah. Yeah. Are you going to see some bands? We're really hoping to get some food and then see some Foo Fighters. Foo ah, Fighters, yes. Yeah. Foo Fighters. <laughs> They're playing two and a half hours. So yeah, <laughs> so we can, we can catch them. Okay, <laughs> thank you very much. Thanks for having us. <laughs>